Now, a different family. In this new family, the reference person is followable, and so is one of the OFAMs. One of the OFAMs is pre-listed as being an educational institutional. Note that only followable FU members will be pre-listed as educational institutionals. In our example family, you confirm that the son is still away at college. However, when you ask about the stepdaughter, our non-followable OFM, you learn she is now in jail. In this new family, the reference person is followable and the wife is not. You find out the reference person is in a nursing home for Alzheimer's patients and cannot do the interview. Or, imagine he is in prison. Or, imagine he is serving in a war and he won't be back home during the data collection period. His wife has been the respondent for the past three waves. Imagine a new family unit. There is only one person living in this household. You find out from another family member that she is in prison for life. Now instead, suppose that you find out that this poor woman is in hospice care, not in prison. She cannot do the interview. Let's look at another real-life situation. You have a non-followable reference person whose followable wife has died and whose followable son is in prison.